Hello, this is Dr. Liu at Li Time. In today's video, I want to demonstrate you how to make a tincture with lemon vagina. If you are new to tincture, good news is not complicated. You are smart enough to handle it. Tincture is an alcohol extraction process. It uses alcohol to extract the essential compounds of phytochemicals out of the herbs. Tincture can be used as a preventive medicine and help improve the body well-being. The alcohol used in tincture is normally range from 40% to 60%. For example, 50% alcohol means 50% of a pure ethanol with 50% of a water. It is popular to see proof on the bottles. Proof is twice as large as a percent. For example, 80 proof vodka has 40% ethanol. With this medium percentage of alcohol, this process is also called hydroalcohol because it can help dissolve water soluble compounds and ethanol soluble compounds. It takes the benefits of the both of these solvents. For some other cases, over 90% of ethanol is used. So that will help dissolve non-water soluble compound. In my last video, I introduced the phytochemistry of a lemon verbena. It has two groups of chemicals, volatile compounds and non-volatile compounds. By doing distillation, the volatile compounds can be extracted out from the lemon verbena, such as geranium and citral. Those are the main compounds within its essential oil and it can be dispersed in hydrosol. It has a similar benefits as its oil. If you want to learn how to make hydrosol at home, watch my last video. Within the non-volatile compounds, verbascoside is the main medicinal functional chemical. It is a phenylpropanoid. It has antimicrobial and anti-inflammatory properties, and it's a good antioxidant. In vitro study proof verbascoside has good neural protection function help prevent the brain from the damage. Clinical study proof it can help reduce the muscle stress after an extensive exercise. Verbascoside is water soluble. It makes a hydroalcohol the perfect way to extract. Alcohol can help break down the cell structure and release the essential chemical into the solvent. And today I'm using the lemon verbena after the distillation because distillation can extract the volatile compounds but leaves the non-volatile compounds within the lemon verbena. It is good to make the tincture. So this is a full spectrum extraction. Hydrosol is perfect for the external use and the tincture is good for the internal use. Because the verbascoside is water soluble, 80 proof vodka or 40% alcohol is a good solvent for extraction. There are two ways to decide how much alcohol to be used with lemon verbena. One way is to keep the herb to alcohol ratio at a 1 to 5. One part weight of lemon verbena and five part volume of alcohol. The other is the old way which is a fully soaking herb and leaves two fingers tall above the herb for consistency of making tincture in the future, it's better to keep the constant ratio. After pour alcohol into herb, stir and mix well so as to help all of the plant material having good contact with the liquid. Then shake it vigorously. Leave it in the kitchen cabinet. A bit warmer temperature can help improve the extraction efficiency and shorten the time to be ready. It normally takes four weeks for the tincture to be ready, but when you make a tincture from a leaf or flower, it takes shorter time than roots, seeds, and a bark. So after this video, I show you a two part. The first part is the distillation to extract the volatile compounds out of the lemon verbena to make hydrosol as a good skin spray and aromatherapy to help you release the stress. And the second part, I show the tincture making with the lemon verbena 
post distillation, it can help extract the verbosco side. It can go into the tincture for the internal use. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you learned something today. Subscribe to the channel and see you next time.